this is Daniel with Living Water Aeration, and uh, thank you for watching my video. This one is entitled Fish Pond Pumps, and I just wanted to make a quick video um, about the keyword fish pond pumps, because what I'm noticing um, after uh, having been online since 2004 selling this type of equipment, um, a lot of times when people say they want a pond pump, um, what they're actually looking for is something to circulate the water, not necessarily just something that's going to pump water. And I'll explain to you what I mean by that in a minute. But whenever someone is looking for a fish pond pump, then that means it's a relatively uh, you know larger pond than you would find. You know, when, when some people say ponds, it can be anything from a little small ornamental thing that is barely the size of a, a rain puddle. And then it can go all the way to, you know, bordering on a lake, you know, huge with, uh, you know, acre, taking up acres of land. Uh, so the word pond can be misleading when people, especially when people are looking online and they're trying to find the right equipment uh, to do the right job. So uh, I kind of just want to talk about that real quick. So if you typed in, uh, you know, pond pump or fish pond pump on Google, you're looking for the right equipment for your pond. Uh, more than likely what you're trying to do is circulate the water in your pond. So if you type that up, you'd get like, you know, some results like this. Let me just, I see a picture here, so I'll just click on that. Um, oh, product not found. Let's try another one. Okay, so for 70 bucks, you get this little bitty pump. And uh, obviously if you have a fish pond, um, this is not exactly going to do the job for you. You know, here's a, a few other ones, $189. What these are going to do is, uh, you know, circulate uh, the water. This one says 560 gallons per hour. That's really not going to get it done for you as far as circulating the water in a fish pond. More than likely, um, what people are looking for when they want a fish pond pump is they want a diffused aerator or an aerator for a larger pond. So let me just show you here. This is our website, Living Water Aeration. And I want to, uh, I want to take a look at this. This is our, one of our best selling units right here, this one acre system. And I want to quickly just uh, show you this right here. This is for a one acre fish pond or you know, one acre pond, period. Uh, it, can it can aerate a lot of water. And instead of pumping water, using electricity and uh, to power a pump that pumps water, what it does is it, it powers a pump that pushes air. And I'll just kind of uh, show you an image of what I'm talking about. It pushes air from the bottom of the pond upward. And, and because it's doing that, it's going to actually, you know, circulate the entire, you know, uh, water column instead of just getting the surface of the water, which some water pumps, that's all they'll do. So anyhow, um, when you're wanting to move a lot of water in a fish pond, you're going to want to use air instead of an actual pump. So what I'm trying to say here is that when you're searching online, you might not want to be looking for a fish pond pump, but maybe a fish pond aerator, which it could be a synonym, but, you know, if you want to get specific, it's an aerator. And you see this plume of bubbles right here coming up from the bottom of the pond? Actually, the deeper you're able to put that diffuser in your pond, like if you were able to go deeper than this, see, this is in a swimming pool right here. But if you were able to go deeper with the diffuser, you would actually get uh, a larger plume. So the deeper you go down, the more bubbles that are sitting on top of that diffuser at any given moment. So on average, this one diffuser can move about 800 gallons of water per minute. That's per minute. To where if you search for a little bitty uh, pond pump, you're going to do 560 gallons per hour. So every minute, you're doing about 560 gallons with this unit. So using air to circulate the water in your pond is going to be much, much more uh, effective than trying to get a water pump. It's going to be more cost effective. It's going to be, uh, you know, um, more efficient. And it's going to do a much better job than, than anything uh, you could do as far as buying a water pump. To move the same amount of water with a water pump, you'd probably need something that costs in the thousands of dollars. And then the electricity bill, you know, that's a whole other story in itself. So, you know, they have them for different size fish ponds. You can get it. This one's for one acre uh, that has one of those diffusers. If you needed something larger, then you'd have like a, a two diffuser kit 
and then these diffusers actually have two heads on them because these compressors um, are actually have enough volume in them uh, to power two of these two diffusers with two heads each. So I hope that kind of clarifies the difference between a, a you know if you're searching for a fish pond pump, you're trying to circulate your water. What you really need, what you're really needing or wanting, is a uh, an aerator. Now um, I plan on making another video to talk about other types of pumps you can get for your pond, especially if you have a shallow pond that's less than five feet deep. Uh, one of the things you might be able to consider is a uh, high oxygen surface aerator. Um, you know, that's another type of fish pond pump. So, you know, I, I invite you to come to livingwateraeration.com, search our site. We have many different kinds of uh, what we call fish pond pumps, fish pond aerators, and we have uh, pond pumps for just about every single type of use and application you could, you could possibly think of. So uh, again, thank you for watching this video. I hope maybe clarified a few things for you. And if you have any questions whatsoever, feel free to call us on our toll-free number right there in the header. Thank you. Thank you.